Hi, this is Barry Mankin here with Four Corners Home Inspections here in Nashville, Tennessee. And in this video, we're going to look at a deck uh, that is underrated outside here. Um, I actually walked on this deck to enter the house before I looked at it. But this is, uh, this deck is going to have to be replaced. There's no way that it should uh, be walked on at this point. Uh, so let's take a look. You've got this area here. You can see there is no, there's hardly any structure existing. They've only got these uh, four by four supports um, here. Uh, they've got a double two by 12 here running, I'm sorry, two by 10 here running uh, the length of each side. And, uh, Nothing along the front here, which supports underneath. Um, this outside should have a double band board here. It should be tied in with the main support. Um, technically, at this point, uh, we're about six feet over there. We should have uh, two by, or I'm sorry, six by sixes for supports, even though this deck is older. So at this point, that would be an update. Uh, but because we don't have any other supports under here whatsoever, um, and for other reasons, uh, this whole deck has to be replaced. Um, there's some slight deterioration on here, but what you can see, we've got some pretty large spacing in here. If you can stick your fist through here um, and not touch, you need a four inch clearance there for safety, for children generally is what that's for. Um, so we've got about six inches. So that's another half as much. Then the railing system itself doesn't have any structure. So normally in this case with this four x four construction, you'd have a four x four post on the end that helps give um, uh, some support for the railing. Uh, that would be split in the same manner, just like you have four x fours here and here. You'd have a four x four here. You'd also have a four x four here at the end, which is really, kind of janky um, the other thing we've got here is where it ties into the house at the joist <clears throat> they just tied it right into the brick here um, and then these Simpson ties here actually are supposed to be attached to this not only that it's got a gap so it's it's actually pulling away from the house this is pulled away here we'd have no flashing whatsoever we can see where this is wet on the framework behind it. So a whole myriad of issues here on this deck between the support, the way it's attached to the house, um, the spacing, the lack of support for the railing. Um, there's just no way that we can uh, not show this as a safety hazard. And we're gonna recommend a certified deck contractor to come out here reevaluate this most likely tear it down and start over with current code standards all right so always want to make sure that some of these issues that we pointed out if you have a deck that has any of these issues you always want to have a safe area to enjoy you know because it's a bad day if that deck comes down or somebody gets hurt so um this is barry with four corners home inspections we just want to make sure that everybody's safe and knows what they're getting when they're buying a home. Get a good inspection.